Okay, so I'm actually taking a video of this because I think that you have to really see this to understand. People wonder why they need to do a termite inspection and why if they see just one little thing why a whole entire building might need to be treated and this is a perfect example the building that we purchased now we knew that we had termites uh, so we were not surprised and I am so grateful that my husband does this for a living because we knew what we were getting into but you have got to see this this is insane so let me actually take you over to the beginning of where this started we believe so I'm walking obviously through walls that were not, they were all uh, taken out because we had an abat abatement crew, a Vestas abatement crew came in, took them out. Um, and so this is like actually a closet. And if you look down here, you can see where there was a water leak for a while. And because of this water leak uh, that was inside this closet, um, the termites came in so you can see all the damage that has started over here but I've got to show you this so check this out so it goes they came all the way up the walls okay you see all these little these are mud tubes this is the remnants of the mud tubes that were within the wall that you don't normally see okay they came all the way along came all the way up all the way across the ceiling they are not on the ground anymore all the way across the ceiling passed over to the other side of the building you see these mud tubes everywhere all over the place this is above my head you think termites are in the ground all over Look at this, almost every single post is covered with mud tubes living inside the walls that you normally would not even realize they were there. Absolutely insane. Look, I'm like all the way on the other side of the building. Look at this, all over the place. Look at that, that's insane, absolutely insane. I'm going around to the other side. You gotta see this. Look at this. All over the place. This is clear on the other side of the building. Jeez. And there's some all the way in the back too. Look at this. Well, I'm not gonna keep going because obviously you probably get the point by now. But let me just remind you, do your termite inspection. And if your termite inspection comes back saying that there are conducive conditions or there's something up and you need to do a treatment, do the treatment, do it. You may think it's nothing, and that there may be nothing going on, but look what could be happening behind your walls and behind your sheetrock. This is insane.